if you like to grill like I do uh, this is the perfect product for you also great for just cooking in the regular oven uh, you can use it for smoking meats also um, you can get it at amazon.com it is from the people makers name is I guess Brett I'm not really sure if I'm saying it correctly sorry if I'm not but that's what I get from it uh, you can go to amazon.com and pick one up for under 25 bucks so when you think of thermometers it's probably not quite what you're thinking it almost looks like a portable phone uh, it looks like you have to have a college education to figure out how to use it but it's actually very simple to use uh, there's basically three parts you get a receiver which is going to have your digital display I'll go over all that and you get a base uh, which that receiver will sit in if when not in use and you get a temperature probe and that's stainless steel so easy cleanup just be careful of the point easy cleanup uh, you got braided stainless steel and there's a reason for all that uh, this male end just plugs right in here to your base and that will get you all started but uh, a few things that I loved about this product it has a huge digital display and I will power it on for you and you can see just how big it is sorry if there's a glare coming off the light but um, you, you get all your different meats up here beef lamb veal uh, hamburger pork uh, turkey chicken fish and back to beef and then you can see right here there's a wide range you go from uh, your cooking types you want you got your rare medium rare medium well done and they give you a set temperature for uh, say a, the beef that you have in your temperature your targeted temperature would be 136 degrees Fahrenheit and that's for rare depending on how many pounds that will change um, but you get a current temperature which obviously nothing's plugged in so you won't be seeing that but it, it, it just makes it so simple you, you you put in what you want if it's meat or lamb uh, go over to a hamburger that's the 162 degrees Fahrenheit would be well done as you can see there's a little arrow under well done it's a little hard to see with the glare but anyways then you have your on off switch you got your meat button uh, taste button uh, centigrade to Fahrenheit button uh, I like that you can also set a temperature and there's a reason for this uh, you get an up and a down which is on your temperature in pounds but what's really nice is you'll get say you have a turkey in the oven you put the probe into the turkey so you'll stick this into the turkey run the braided end line out right through the oven door and then you'll just shut the oven door and plug that male end that's on this into your base and then it, everything's set and then you'll just carry the handset with you and an alarm will go off when it's at your preferred temperature so you don't have to keep holding anything keep opening the oven and sticking anything in it's already stuck in the braided line fits perfect right out of your oven door it won't you know impede anything and then you just set this either in the kitchen which it does fit nicely in that stand as you can see there and also on the back of this unit there is a kickstand which just pops out and you can set the unit right on top of your table and set it and forget it's what I like to say and basically that's what you do you just set your temperature stick the probe in it and you're good to go uh, no more it, like I used it at a, a cookout where I s just stuck it in a, a pork butt that was on the grill 
and kept the uh, the remote receiver. I kept this part, the remote receiver, over at the table where we were playing cards or whatnot. Whenever the temperature uh, alarm went off, I just ran over and flipped the pork butt or took it off, depending on where you're at on your cooking, and you're good to go. Uh, it has a huge range of temperatures. Uh, you can go from 32 degrees Fahrenheit to 572 degrees Fahrenheit. I'd also calibrate that in Celsius for you. Uh, but like I said, the digital display is huge. You can see just how big it is when it's off. It looks even bigger. Uh, the buttons are simple to use. There's no no fuss with anything on this. Uh, there is a Celsius to Fahrenheit button right back there also. Uh, a, a reset button also. Um, but you got your kickstand. You just stick the probe in your meat, carry this with you, or set this down, whichever you prefer. And an alarm goes off when your meat's at your preferred temperature. So, it's simple as that. But don't forget how safe this stuff is. Uh, the, the, uh, these, temp these probes are. They're, uh, you know, you got to have your meat done at the right temperatures. And this just takes all the guesswork out of it. So, I highly re recommend you jump on over to Amazon and pick one up before they're all sold out. Uh, you can visit me at techgeeks.com, that's T-E-C-K geeks.com, for more reviews. And you can also post comments. I will answer anything, anything you got, just ask. We'll fix you up with an answer somehow, or I'll look it up for you. Uh, you can also follow me on YouTube, which I hope you all do, so you can get the videos first. Leave comments there also, or even on Amazon. I answer them every place. I usually answer them on my website first because I'm always there. Until the next one.